all over the room. Oh, Step into the interview chair, oh, Alice. So, uh, so you joined our team. Uh, how many months ago, roughly? Oh, six. Six months ago. Oh my goodness. Maybe longer. Okay. And what did you start here as? I started here as just procurement. Just procurement. Just, sorry, just oh. just <laughs> getting in all the food uh, for the entire organisation. Okay. And now, yes. what is your role? Oh my god. A little bit of everything, um, uh, including. <laughs> uh, so I'm I'm in procurement still, so I'm still working and getting in all the food, and I've managed to bring in loads of stuff, like uh, four pallets of 20 kilos of kebab meat. Um, managed to fill up all of our freezers for that. That was good. Um, I also help run the entire store and ensure that it fits your vision. Uh, I make sure that well, I try to make sure that the shelves are clear. Uh, it's a bit difficult sometimes. <laughs> um, I uh, do a lot of uh, networking and liaising with a lot of other uh, community groups and I help build the relationships with that. Um, oh my god. So in particular, let's pull into the diversity for dinner because oh, yeah. uh, that is something that when I talk to the uh, talk to you about diversity for dinner, your face lights up. Yeah. And so what is it about that project that you absolutely love? Everything. It, 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 um, when, when you when I went in for my original interview, which was that I sat down and said, "Can I have a job?" and you went, "Yeah." Uh, <laughs> um, <laughs> oh, why was that? Well, like, I, um, I said that uh, I was really excited to work somewhere with heart uh, because before I used to do a lot of work in the caring industry. So I mean, I worked uh, in schools. I was a nurse support assistant, uh, and I've also worked in um, healthcare as well. And I always found that it was it was missing a step, uh, and it never felt like you could give back as much you were always just following rules and following a system and it felt here like oh my god we can actually do things and with diversity for dinner it's incredible because not only are you you know helping uh, feed people you're helping give people dignity you're helping bring people together you're helping create conversations around really important um, political and ethical issues uh, and you're just helping build communities and it's amazing so the the last diversity for dinner um, I had to somehow coordinate and it's <laughs> whoops how did that happen <laughs> oh it was it was it was quite stressful trying to get it all pulled together and then the way it all went was just beautiful um, so being able to call in a favour to work with uh, Cafe Bridge who have been helping out so much with um, our community fridge for their homeless drop-ins to be able to use their kitchen and for them to supply volunteers for us to supply our own volunteers and for all of us to actually be involved in cooking ourselves I learned a lot about uh, Turkish culture as well um, and a lot about uh, how much you meant about friendship, uh, meze, so literally for friendship. Did you know that? Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's why I had all the hummus on everything. You didn't share that till just now. Oh, sorry. <laughs> um, <laughs> uh, but it was just beautiful to see it come together and we 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 served the food late because we didn't realize how much food there was to compare but then when we came down and i was able to see that people were mixing together and they're all enjoying the food it was beautiful and it, you know and the the atmosphere in there is just getting better and better and better each time and it's lovely and so what has it done for you how do you feel now compared to how you felt before you started working with us I feel much more confident. Uh, I feel I feel like I can do more than they ever thought I could, and I've got a lot more freedom now as well. I'm always uh, because I myself am neurodivergent, and I, I've known for a while, I've known since COVID, and I was like, oh, that makes so much sense now. Um, but I've always known that uh, I can really struggle with instruction, and I can really struggle with uh, rigidity. Is that a word? It's a word now. Um, <laughs> And uh, just in being able to have the space to figure myself out and to figure out my own personal authority and everything like that, my confidence has skyrocketed uh, and I'm much more capable now. I can do a lot more than I ever thought I could. You should be very proud. <laughs> I certainly am. Thank you, Alice. Thank you.